Hey guys, it's your girl Miss Shake coming at you with another quick beauty haul. Hopefully, I think this is my last one, this is my last one, but with me, you'll never know. Starting off real quick into nail polishes. I was at Walmart, I believe, the other day. Yeah, I think it was Walmart. Pretty sure it was. I picked up four new Revlon nail polishes. Actually, I had picked up six, but Victoria poured out two of the bottles completely. Not impressed. But yeah, those are here to show because there's no point. They're empty. But I picked up Vixen. It's a really nice deep burgundy color. Naughty. It's like a dual chrome taupey color with like a purple undertone. Fashionista which is a pretty dark teal, as well as Saucy, which is like an orange with like a gold reflex to it. Stop by Winners, because I'm always there, and I picked up three new Essie polishes and an Essie base coat. So I got the Essie Bates coat in the Ridge Filling one. Yes, we can. After. Okay. I picked up Love and Acceptance. It's really nice pastel purple. I grabbed. What is this? Like to be bad. It's a really nice, pretty pink. These are all pastel colors, actually. And this is Who is the Boss. I'm currently wearing it on my nails. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Then, a couple, maybe a week and a half ago, Shoppers Drug Mart was having uh, 20 times the points. So basically, if you spent $75, you got 20 times the points. And I did so. As well, she's driving me crazy, guys. She keeps playing at the door. Sorry. So yeah, and as well as they had like an extra coupon if you spent forty-four dollars, you got an extra forty-four dollars on Smashbox products. You'd get an extra eight thousand points, which is like ten dollars. So I went two different times. The first time. I think you only had to spend $50, I believe. I think it was $50 the first time. Because it was like within two weeks of each other, they had two of those promotions. So, first thing I got was the Naked 2 palette. It comes with the double-ended brush. 12 shadows, Foxy, Bleak Hall, T, Suspect, Verb, Busted, Blackout, YDK, Pistol, Snake Bite, Chopper, and Half-Baked. I thought I'd get it. I almost got the Nake the original, but I figured they'd have another 20 times a point sale and I'd get it then. I thought I'd get this. I haven't used it yet, it's still like wrapped up. Then for Smashbox, I picked up the Photo Finish Lip Primer and the Big Legendary Lipstick in Cha Chai. Oh, I've never even opened this yet. Oh, looks like that's a pretty nude color. And along with the, that, like, I had spent a whole how much over, I picked up Vera Wang Princess Night Night Princess. I got that one. I love Vera Wang perfumes, and honestly, they smell amazing, and so I had to get this one. I really want to get the new one, Love Struck, but I haven't gotten it yet. But that's next on my list. Then, this past weekend, shoppers had um, the, the L'Oreal Infallible Shadows on sale for $5.99. So I grabbed three. I did grab some in my last haul video. I haven't even used those yet, but seeing these are $5.99. 
I wanted to try them out. One second. So this one is Eternal Black. It has like sparkles in it. Yeah. Hourglass Beige. And Purple Obsession. I ended up picking up another Maybelline color tattoo. Wait, wait, wait. Another Maybelline color tattoo. I got the one in something asphalt. I don't know how to say that, so I'm not going to pronounce it. But it's like the silvery gray one. I don't even know how I'll ever use this, but I thought I'd get it anyways. Then, I made a purchase on Hot Look maybe three weeks ago, whenever they had Lorac. I haven't tried Lorac before, and I've been waiting for it to come in so I can make this video. I picked up two items. I got this baked matte satin eyeshadow in inside. Dirt. It's really pretty blue. That's the color. That's the color of my hand. Okay, let me really show that one, baby. Then, that was like only $2. And I can't remember what they said the retail price was, but that cost me $2. And then I picked up the 3D Glitz palette. It has six shadows. And this was only like 12 bucks, I think. 12 or 10. So it was a really good deal. And with shipping, I only spent 22 bucks, which was less than the shadow. Wait, Victoria. Why? Sorry, guys. Okay. Yes, it's still sparkly. Then I stopped by Sephora maybe a month ago because I had time to kill one day on my break. So I announced, oh, actually, because my Clinique moisturizing gel moisturizer was almost finished. So I went and got the three care step because when I had my interview with Clinique whenever so long ago. She had let me know that I had oily combination and this all together would work really well for my skin. And since she recommended it, I thought I'd get it the next time I ran out. So I picked that up. It was only $45, I believe, I think. Then I picked up the Smashbox Complexion Perfection Kit in the color dark. Came with the HD foundation in dark one, the HD concealer in dark, the photo finish primer, and the halo to glow in dark. I love this kit. I haven't used the primer yet, but I love, love, love the foundation and concealer. It's going to be my next video because I'm doing my June, May favorites, which I haven't done a favorites in forever. But yeah, it's going to be in there. And lastly, seeing as in the lineup for so long, I picked up the Their Real Mascara from Benefit. I got the new one. So I can't wait to give that a try. Oh, I missed something. I picked up the new, the Mega Plush, Plush Volume Express Mascara from Maybelline. Super excited to try this. I got this for $4.99 at Shoppers. So yeah, that's my quick haul. And I will see you guys in my next video. And have a good day. Bye.